Welcome to this Windows channel and this is the follow-up video on our series on the task manager. We'll take a look at the um, disk drive or the C drive or the different drives that you have through the task manager. Right click on the taskbar at the bottom, go into task manager. At the top you go on performance and make sure that you select disk. So you might have multiple disks, by the way. Uh, for example, my desktop has multiple disks because it shows up in the um, different drives. So for example, if you have a card reader, if you have a USB thumb drive plugged in and so on, they will all appear here. And basically this is information about the access and how um, it is accessed frequently or not. So first information you get is a disk. So disk 0, C is the main drive of my system. On the right side, you know what type of disk it is. It has its serial number. Uh, WDC here is the Western Digital Corporation. So this is a Western Digital hard drive in my computer with its serial number. So you can search that on the web and know what type of drive it is. Below it, you have a graphical time, display time of the uh, access of your hard drive. So uh, just for the, the test, let's say that I take Windows Defender. And in Windows Defender, I'm going to say, let's do a scan. And now you'll have peaks because the Windows Defender is now going to, of course, use a lot of my hard drive. And you see here it's peaking at almost 100% because it's being used by Windows Defender. Cancel scan and we're going back to normal. Here we go. So basically what you want to see in that graphical display, you do want spikes. It's normal to have spikes, uh, but you don't want to have your hard drive 100% all the time. That means something is using your hard drive a lot. Something needs to be done. Something needs to be uh, checked out. And you know the usage of your hard drive because if you go in processes and you click disk on the top, you'll be able to see what uses your hard drive. So once again, let's do the test with the uh, <coughs> Windows Defender and uh, have it uh, scan. And you'll see that Windows Defender will become the app that has the main usage suddenly as the drive while it's scanning. It's going to tell you, well, OK, and here we go. Anti-malware service executable is taking a lot of the space and you see it becomes red to say that it's well okay it's really solicitation of the hard drive so it's the information of usage of your hard drive you don't want to have it of course 100 percent all the time but it will be normal that it sometimes spikes it can be normal if there's a scan of some sort that it 100 percent for a while but you don't want it all the time there it should actually be used less bottom other graphical display is the transfer rate. This is the speed, the amount of n megabytes per second, amount of data that is transferred. It gives you an idea of the overall performance of your hard drive. A faster hard drive will have typical faster uh, transfer rates. A SSD will have a much higher transfer rate than this. So depending on your hard drive, um, not all hard drives are created equal. Then you have at the bottom First, on the right side, the capacity of your hard drive. So here it says 932 gigabyte. So te technically, this is a one terabyte drive. Now you might say, well, it says 932. It's not a one terabyte drive. Well, that's the trick. There's a kind of a, a way of saying things um, where you know they're going to say, well, this is two terabytes or one terabyte, or and you never have actually. That would be one terabyte if it was formatted. Uh, you know, equally everywhere and all the little parts used. But the thing is, the format, when you actually format an NTFS or any uh, format your hard drive, there's part of it that's lost due to an indexing table that is created. So you never have the total amount that is said on the hard drive, always a little less. Formatted 931 gigabytes. And finally, system disk means this is the main disk for the Windows operating system. And it says, does it page file? Yep, this is where Windows has its page file system. 
On the left side, for information, active time. So basically, it's an average. If it's being used, it's going to tell you the average uh, percentage of the time that it's active doing something. On the right side, the average response time in milliseconds. This is the time it takes for your hard drive to go from a state of zero, doing nothing, to reading or writing something uh, in milliseconds. You've got a read, read speed, so depending on what it's doing, it's going to tell you how much uh, kilobytes per second or megabytes per second it's transferring in its read speed. And of course, the write speed also is shown. So basically, this is the main drive. It uh, is an interesting page because if you have multiple hard drives, you can actually look at, uh, you know, write a file on a drive, look at its performance through here, see which drive may be faster than another. Um, always remember, the main C drive is always a little slower than external drives that don't have an operating system on them. Why? Because Windows is often trying to read or write something to the drive. And um, the down to earth information you need to know here is mostly is it overused because especially with well pr pretty much all drives a drive that is overused might fail um, in a shorter lapse time so for example a drive that would be at 100 percent here will maybe have a lifespan that is much shorter than a drive that is almost never used. That's why you don't want to have 100% used all the time. If so, go into the processes, check out what is using your hard drive all the time. Um, you know, it's worth investigating what's happening. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe to my channel. You'll be informed when new videos are online. Give us a thumbs up if you like the videos. Hopefully you like this series and thank you for watching.